All right, you guys, so I am here. It is late at night. We put the kids to bed, and I am here with Joseph Buell. He is joining me for today's video. Hello, Joseph. Hello. Say hello to everybody. So a lot of you guys had told me that you guys have no idea what to get your husbands for Christmas. So we're gonna do our version of like a men's gift guide by basically showing you all of Joe's favorite things. So we're gonna walk around the house and I'm gonna make him tell us some of the things that he really likes and enjoys. And I'll have everything linked down below in the description box. Joe's a very strange person. So a lot of the things that he likes, you know, may apply to your guy in your life or may not, but these are the things that he really likes. All right, Buell. I tend to be expensive. Yes, he also tends to be kind of expensive, so just be warned. Not high maintenance. Though. Not high maintenance, just a little bit expensive. Oh, and by the way, like we're packing to be like leaving tomorrow, so like there's like stuff everywhere, so just bear with us. Right, so a lot of Joe's favorite things wind up here on his side table. So, what? Where are you gonna start? What's your favorite thing over there? I like hats. I don't wear hats often, but I like hats. Small company, Eagles and Angels, E-N-A. They take uniforms from first responders, military, special ops guys, and they donate their uniforms to this company, and this company takes their uniforms and cuts out American flag. This is leather with the uniform piece behind it. So, for example, this hat was uh, Dom Rosso. This was his uniform. Dom Rosso was a uh, Navy Special Warfare dev group SEAL Team 6 guy, so. Very cool. Um, I didn't even know that. Yeah, they have a lot of cool things, but when they have their specialized hats go out, based on whoever it is, uh, they go pretty quick. So if you're interested, you gotta jump on it quick. Well, you've got that one and what, you have the black one? I like the black one. Yeah, the black one is, it's nothing really special about this one. It's just uh, one of their baseline, I guess. Hats. Awesome. Eagles and angels. I like it. Well, what about your socks? Find your find your socks because that's like a favorite thing. That's always like a good I, gift. I pack them. You pack them? Well, you got to take them out. No you, way. You got to take them out. Can't happen. You can take out your socks. I can't. Do you know where they, like it goes shoes, socks. <laughs> this is how <laughs> Joseph packs his suitcase. It's pretty bad too. It's, it's packed. Man, you're screwing me up. I'm sorry. You can do this. I believe in you. Not cool. You really can't find them for real? All right, you got him? Yes. Beautiful. Socks ever. So these are like, I have no affiliate link, no code for them or anything like that. These are the Divi Up socks. So that's a website. You go to Divi Up and then you can upload a photo. Oh my God, I love these so much because they have both of the kids. But you basically upload a photo and then you can, you know, choose however many faces you want. And Joe wears those all the time now. So well, I felt bad because you bought me a pair for Riley. Mm -hmm. Then you bought me a pair for Jackson. And then I was like, well, hell, I can't just... I was literally thinking of wearing one Riley, one Jackson. Yeah, he was gonna wear one of each, but then I got him a new pair of both the kids' faces. So those are definitely a favorite. We really like those. So those make for a great gift. All right, that's the last thing I'll make you take out there, I promise. The people that train, and you need to train where place requires you to have a mask. Company mission. Mission? What's so special about this mask? It's a mask that really is designed for people that are working out and have to wear a mask. I haven't really had to use it yet. Mm -hmm. Since I work out at home, obviously. But why? Because it doesn't fall off of your face? Correct. Oh, okay. And it's, you know, really meant for breathing. Very cool. Maximizing the breathing, I guess. Big Bose fan, so I have a lot of different Bose products, but those are pretty pricey. That is one that, did you get it from me and then I just yeah, never, used never used it? it. So he uses it now. Put and speakers around your neck. Yeah. It's nice. So then you hear it like better, yeah. right? Because it's on your neck? Correct. I come for 35. Those are the best because I even have a pair. Those are very expensive gifts, but if you're looking for a pair of like noise canceling, like headphones like that, that is definitely the way to go. The and quiet comfort ones. Husbands are better haves or boyfriends, whatever, are readers. Jack Carr, Terminal List, Savage Son. He's about to come out with a new book. Great books. Very good. I also like Clint Emerson. 100 deadly, 100 deadly skills, skills or what, what the heck is in there 100 deadly skills survival edition so it's all just right. different things it's crazy things that you can learn how to do a mobile surveillance or how to spot a mobile surveillance how to detect a tracking device in your car how to clone a key clone a key wow why the heck would you need to clone a it's key just, and it's fascinating stuff okay very very interesting the survival edition teaches you how to minimum edc everyday carry wetland environment what you need in a wetland environment. So just teaching you how to like survive in the wilderness? Build an elevated swamp bed. Oh, that's pretty cool. So you if you're ever in the swamp. Down with the creatures. <laughs> Very cool. Emergency climbing techniques. All right. Uh, 
survive a home invasion. Okay, that's important yeah. for sure. Maybe we'll little... read that page. Charger is a, it's called company Skosh and it says Base Links, L-Y-N-X. Um, this is a cool charger because it charges like three things, right? Well, it's, it's modular, so. What does that mean? These means that you kind of fit them together. So if you only have one phone and an iWatch or an Apple Watch, you can just buy this and this. Oh, okay. But I have two phones, personal work and an Apple Watch. So when you, you buy them all separately? You have to buy them all separately when you bought I it? I bought a pack or uh, they've had a, one where it was this and the Apple Watch charger. And then this was separate. And then this little end piece is separate as well. But this allows you to plug in extra stuff chargers. but he can basically just like put his phone here and then it charges right is that charging oh that way okay oh, it doesn't matter either way but. but yeah so it's like the kind of charger that you don't have to plug it in so you just put it there and then the same thing with his i got apple it off watch. amazon but i think uh, apple sells it too my hatch thanks to the kids <laughs> he loves his little hatch. hatch sound machines i just Sleeping in silence now just gets me. So. Yeah, so the kids have their hatch, and so now Joe got used to sleeping with white noise. So now Maybe the kids were in here with us in the past. I night. know. So now he has his hatch, and it works like the same way as the kids' one. And then it's also a nightlight. A nightlight, and you can also use the app on your phone, right? Just yeah, the same. Yeah, different sounds. You can make it do uh, that light. You can have it do a sequence where it's like a a cool down point or a kind of just chill out point and then you go to sleep and reading you can change the light colors you can change the sounds no oh, careful you can have that. it be an alarm where it kind of wakes you up with light and sound oh very cool what about that columbia thing that you're wearing right now because that's like the only long sleeve thing that you ever wear yeah so i, I wear a lot of columbia it's a great brand but more I, i'm part of their they have a pro program so if you're in some profession that requires you to be that's outdoors like fish and wildlife or law enforcement they have a, a discount program a discount program you can sign up for what's your discount you get like 25 percent off no it's it's more it's than like that 40 to 50 percent. okay very good that's why you buy all the columbia <laughs> things so that's a big reason why i'm kind of big columbia guy but they're nice like they, they look nice you look pretty <laughs> you look really nice <laughs> what about in your closet anything that you didn't pack well probably most of what you really like you probably packed don't you have a couple of those grunt style shirts i do you want to show me those? Bring them over here. It's important we have kids. <laughs> Whiskey Elves. That's a very nice shirt. But the brand is this right here. It says Grunt Style. And they have a whole bunch of different prints. So Joe gets a bunch of their t-shirts. They're really cute. He likes to work out. These are the best training shoes ever. What are those? Those are the CrossFit shoes, no? Reebok Nano. Reebok Nanos. Yeah, I love them. What about those pants that I tell you that your butt looks really nice in them? What uh, are those? <laughs> it's okay. If they're in there, that's fine. I can put a picture of them. I'll have you show me where they are. Away. But those are good workout pants is oh, that a no, specific no, brand no, no, no. you didn't take them i didn't take them all. Ten thousand. no they don't cost ten thousand dollars that's the name of the company, the of the company. ten thousand so those are his teeny tiny workout shorts they're very short but the material is really nice yeah. the material of these is super nice and they're linered i usually like to get the ones with liners in it so you don't wear underwear no that's like your keeps everything in check okay very good what size do you wear in those uh, is that a small? I mean, it looks small. Yeah, they're small. <laughs> those are small. <laughs> and then those are the pants. The same company or a different same company? company. Ten thousand. And these are really nice workout pants. So the big thing I like about these two is, is they have this little zipper pocket. So when I'm running, my iPhone fits in here perfectly, nice and secure in my pocket. And it's not like floating mind. around in I there. Have to have it on my arm. Very good. You have your Apple Watch that you wear yeah. all the time, and those. I sleep, I sleep with it. Yeah. So it tracks my sleep and wakes me up without having a audible alarm. So it vibrates on my Yes, stuff. he he's very techy, does all those things. Love backpacks. He does like backpacks. Yeah, so this is a company called Go Ruck. Um, US company. This is their G R one shooter bag. Um, this is by far the best backpacks you can buy. They are high quality. But it looks so plain. Yeah, it has a little pocket for your like computer? computer this is really plain but um super great super good back you have the other one downstairs right is that the I one that's like in your office three or four. Oh, okay i like your dance is there anything in the bathroom at all that you can think of bathroom is a mess what about your your manscape <laughs> your manscape 
to shave off all of the hairs. Naturally kind of a hairy guy. <laughs> He's a very hairy guy, which I like, and then he that shaves it all off. Pieces of my stomach hair and it was hurt. Yes, hurt. but you got it and it's like supposed to just be like an easier way to trim all that stuff. It's right. like a manscaping it's tool. It's rechargeable, it's waterproof and it's got a little light. Little light? Yeah, it's got a little uh, guard so it doesn't, you know, it's not like completely zero. All right. Um, How much does this thing cost you? It's like 50 bucks. Oh my God. What about your hair tool, your hair thing? Uh. There was a place in Miami that I was getting my hair cut and the guy used this Layrite um, ProMate on my hair and I liked it, bought a thing of it and you can get this stuff on Amazon. Yeah, fun fact, I've been using yeah, that lady for my it. baby hairs. For all of the postpartum little baby hairs, I'll take a little bit of that and I'll just like kind of like spread it in between my fingers and I just go like that and then it kind of helps the baby hair stay so it's like a gel but it's not like as like slicked back as like with real gel I guess yeah. I don't know but whatever it's here in the bathroom yeah. and I steal it from him so yeah we'll link that too we're doing Dollar Shave Club both of us use Dollar oh yeah shave club. we do we do the Dollar Shave Club we've been doing it for years and we have like a million that's like a stack of freaking razors because they send you razors every month and we don't go through all of them, so we have a ton. What else can you think of? There's nothing else in here. Okay. I'm very bare bones. Yes, all right, let's go downstairs then. So this is like Joe's little office space over here where he's been doing all his work from home it's stuff. Mess, it is a mess. Uh, I told you I'm a backpack guy. Huge fan of a company, same company. I just, I don't know if I mentioned it. Oh, it's a guy, Dom Ross. Yeah. So he has a company in Virginia Beach. But he designs apparel and uh, different pieces of equipment. This is his newest backpack called the Comp LVL. So again, carrying for, for personal protection, um, carrying a gun. This backpack is a really nondescript sling type backpack and you do double straps too. I just took the single, just went with a single. It allows you to quickly have a gun, your holster gun that you traditionally carry uh, concealed. You can mount it here. So this is where I put the one that I carry, but it allows me to not have to carry, but be able to draw very nice, very quickly. And you can also put the plate in the, that one, right? Yeah, they. I didn't buy it yet, but they have a. They have two types of plates. They have a ballistic three and a three A plate, which is for armor piercing rounds. Okay, I don't know what any of that means. I just know but that there's like a plate plate that has a pocket in here. So when you put it here. You can use it as a means to protect yeah, it can your protect body. Yeah, your vitals, your vitals, heart. Which is pretty cool. Yeah. Very yeah. nice. So that's the Dynamis bag, because you didn't say it was Dynamis. Dynamis Alliance is the name of the company. What else do you have from Dynamis? I have pants, I have their holsters. Yeah, they have really nice t-shirts too. I have their blade. Um, yeah, I have their shirts. Good stuff, that company. That's a good company to look Stance, into. face mask, really comfortable. This guy has like 5,000 face masks. He keeps ordering more. Okay, what else in here? Uh, another go rough bag. Another backpack, okay. This is the rucker. This one you fit a plate in here so those exercise enthusiasts that want to do rucking, there's a plate pocket for their special plates, which is nice. I do play video games. When do you have time to play video games? He used to play video games. Bought this. Yes. He got the Oculus, which is super cool. Super yeah. cool, I tried it out a couple times, yeah. but he's played it like maybe two times. We're gonna get to it. We are, eventually, one day, when the children are 19 and 20 years old. I don't really play console games anymore. I do a online called Shadow.Tech. Uh, it's a cloud-based PC, so you can play PC games at the highest quality. That's the thing that we have to pay monthly for? Yes, yeah, like 14 bucks for the baseline. And then you have to buy a controller too? No. No, it's just $14 a month, and then you use it on your computer? Anything you can do on your tablet, your iPad, your iPad. Shadow Tech. Shadow dot tech. Shadow dot tech. Okay, very cool. This over here, this box, this is another company that just took a ton of my money. This is our a, money. Yes, our money. Sorry, our money. It's a company called Goal Zero, and this is the generator that we bought for our like power bank anniversary. <laughs> this is our anniversary gift right here. So they have generators. They have other things. They have lanterns. They have a bunch of different things that help you what like survive if you lose power if you lose power thing. i don't know if your guy's into like that kind of stuff it's 3000 watts it can run like a standard fridge for 55 hours but yeah they have cool stuff. that's the big thing 
yeah it does powered. solar powered so it's it's cool like the company is is cool if your guy likes that kind of stuff bring your wine because we're gonna show them all of our yetis all of the yetis that you have our entire That's collection insane. of yetis all right Buell, so let's see all of the yetis see what else in here Yeti. these are definitely great Yeti. gifts Yeti. oh my god <laughs> not sponsored by yeti but i mean we really should be at this point no no, no. we have to leave them in there because it's ridiculous yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. So how about you talk, first of all, okay. So yes, we have a bazillion Yetis. These are actually really nice. This is like the veteran one that just came out, right? Yeah. For Veterans Day or something. So we've got these regular tumblers that, what's, how many ounces is this? 16. 16 ounces? Well, 20 ounces. 20 ounces. So we have a bunch of these, and they come with like different lids too, right? Yeah. Then there's this one. That's more for what, just like drinking? Whiskey. Whiskey? Football. Yeah. So just this little tiny cup. But I'm a fan of their new copper. The copper stuff is really nice. And steel. And the steel. So we have, of course, both. This is for what? Sir. To put a beer in? Yeah, and to keep it? Yeah. So you put the beer can yeah. in there. So we've got some of those. This is the coffee one. So he got me a coffee one and then he has a black coffee one somewhere but these are nice for that. And then these are the newest ones that we got that, what's what's so special about these? Like that they just have a handle. They're 24 ounces bigger, but yeah, it's got a handle. And then they also have wine ones. So he has a wine tumbler, I have one, and then a whole gallon is that one? It has the, the handle and everything. So it, we've taken this to a lot of places, like whenever. Veterans or uh, first responders, I believe you get a 20, 25% discount. On those? On their website when you order. So the good thing about these, like the reason why they're so popular is that they keep your stuff really cold or really yeah, hot. There's other companies, there's Orca, there's Arctic. Yeah. Just, I've had Arctic before and I just, I'm telling you, Yetis are just, they just feel more quality. They feel more expensive. Because they are. They are more expensive. Yes, are. exactly. Sure. But I just, I just, I'm a quality over, it just feels Yes, good. you have good taste, you have expensive taste. I, I get that. So yeah, we've got all of the Yetis. What else you got in here? Remember the coffee? What? You got, you got that? That's what that thing is? Yeah, the portable coffee. Okay, so how about you start off then by showing them what this is because then it'll make more sense. Because I get a lot of questions about our coffee system. Chemex. So this is the Chemex system. You can buy this giant piece this separate. on their Chemex website. Unique. Yeah, it's separate. You can only get it on the Chemex website. It's what filters the water down. Like you fill this yeah. up, so it just the water the comes. Water, hot water. So typically you buy just this. Yeah, typically you'll just buy that. You have either paper or normal filters to put the water and then you get a kettle. You either an electric kettle that heats the water up and plug it in or even as simple as hot water on a stove and then you just pour over so it's, that's how you brew your coffee it does taste a lot better than just traditional you know drip coffee filtered coffee maker in my opinion so we've Keurig. had it for a long time so yeah. we like it better than a keurig system cheaper than a keurig system for sure if you buy just that yeah, this and the coffee grounds. Yeah, then it's cheaper than the Keurig, but yeah. that thing by itself this is like three hundred dollars or something. So this that. just replicates the pour over where you don't have to be here for ever. Yeah, boring. but you can start off with that and then just with your hand, you know, pour yeah, the just water buy an in. Yeah, electric kettle, which yeah. isn't that expensive, and just you know, water kettle and just pour over hot water. But that is the kind of system that he likes to use a, for his coffee. It has a heating element, so it keeps the coffee. Yeah. Hot. We also so make typically when you do the pour over when you're done pouring over, you just put it on your stove. Turn your stove on low, and that's what keeps your because this is. Safe you can put for that the on the stove. Yeah. So yeah, so he likes that so much that he went and he bought this thing, which is for like this when he's for work whenever I get office. back to the building. But um, so I'm not going to buy coffee. So this is Pact P A K T is the name of the company. Um, they were a Kickstart company, and they they made it so. They made it. Yeah. They survived. They have a filter, a stainless steel uh, portable filter right here, flat. Literally, everything. Your little coffee scoop. And then the. Uh... That's the thing that you plug in, and put the stuff on. Yeah. So there's a button. There's a light on it. Plug that in. The coffee. Take this off. So here's your little pour over. Right. You know, little thing. Pull this out. It's like a little the Russian 
doll stuff looks like. There's like a lot of pieces in that. Yeah, so it's those pieces. This is your cup. This is the top for the cup. Put those here. Fill this with water. There's a fill point. Put it on there. You hit the button and then it starts to heat your water. Then the little cap that was inside the cup that you drink from is where you keep your coffee grounds. Oh, you already have coffee in there. Yeah. And then you use your scoop. Scoop out the coffee. You put the little filter in here. You pour, put your three scoops in there. Wait for this to go off and it will tell you when it's done. It'll light up and blink and make a beeping noise. And you take the coffee and you you pour it. You pour it. And Very done, interesting. You take that off. You have coffee. Very nice. I mean, you're killing me with the fact that there are like a million pieces to this, but if there's someone that, you know, really likes their coffee and is liking this pour over travel thing. travel all the time. Yeah. But it's not that complicated, honestly. I think it's very cool. I think it's a very interesting thing. So he has his little it, man. case that he keeps it in and then he can take it to work. And then you become the designated coffee guy at work. I'm the coffee barista. <laughs> Your barista at work. I love it. Magic spoon cereal. It's <laughs> the cereal for the super rich. Oh my God. He, he's been dying to open this up because this is Healthy something. cereal that doesn't <laughs> taste like this box. It's, it doesn't taste like a box, I promise. Okay, so the backstory, I'm working with this company. They had sent me... Keto-friendly, <laughs> non-GMO, gluten-free, grain-free, soy-free, wheat-free, nothing artificial, childlike cereal, okay. grown-ups. Got it. They had sent me this cereal to try. He ended up loving it. And so now I'm working with them. The box has been there for what, like a week? And I've been salivating. Yes, and he's been dying to open it up. And I tell him he can't touch it until like, I think it's like another two weeks. But Magic Spoon is something, you know, if you're, it expensive. it's super, super expensive. expensive, but if your husband is into like fitness and also like cereal, their cereal is really cool for that. It's like protein cereal almost like it's kind of like a protein bar, but in cereal form and the packaging is really cute and stuff. So that's something that I'll be talking to protein, you guys about soon. Jocko Mulk, Jocko Willink, Origin Labs. It's a really kind of healthy Protein? protein. Okay, and right. you put this in just like a protein shake. With, uh, almond milk. Almond milk. Yeah, almond milk I and that. I do this and from Redcon One, uh, creatine. Creatine. Non-flavored. Free. I use Redcon One. Total Warfare. Total War. Okay, so that's like your whole little workout yeah. Pre, stuff. Post. And then this is post too, right? The protein. Yeah. During. During. Liquid IV. Yes. Keep you hydrated. I actually had one this morning and it was this awesome. Stuff is awesome. Yeah. No, he went and he bought that all on his own. He had seen, was it a targeted ad? No, I've, I've seen it for a while. I've heard about it for a while. Yeah. He had I seen just it. I never pulled the trigger on buying it. Yeah. And then he bought it and then he's like, you got to try it. And it was actually very good. So I can see why a lot of people mention it. Like, I thought it was maybe like one of those things that, you know, just all the influencers get sent this and, you know, maybe it's not that great, but it was actually very good. So. We are fans of this. We're gonna order some more. What else you got? For the whiskey drinkers. Or yes. Or mixed drink drinkers in the house. This is called the flask cap. It's called the flask cap, so I like whiskey. So I use my little bottle. It literally fits on most all your typical uh, stainless steel Yeti type glasses. But you put your whiskey in here. Wait, where do you put the whiskey? In here. Inside there? Inside the cap. Close this. And then, put that on top, you got your little drink spout here, and when you want a little spritz or a refresh, you just hit the button and it dispenses an ounce of whiskey your content into, back into your thing. But why would you want to put more whiskey into the drink that already has? Well, this whiskey. alleviates you, even it's, it's called flask, so typically you have to bring a flask with you if you're alcohol, and then when you want to refill, you have to pour from your flask. This oh, is kind of an incognito way of doing it. Oh, interesting. So you put, instead of carrying a flask, you just take your flask cap, you put your drink in here. And then you just press the button and you get a refill? Yeah, one ounce. <laughs> Very nice. So you can, if you like, I don't know, rum and coke or, you know, Jack and coke, um, you can put your coke in here and then you, there's your mix. And then when you finish that, you still got whiskey, you pour more coke and you push the button again. 
Very nice. I'm glad that kind of stuff makes you so happy. Four Yetis down here. Oh my goodness. Wait, so these are which ones? These are like... Those are Ramblers. Ramblers? I think they're called Ramblers, yeah. But I just, what is the point of, how is that one different than listen, the other one? Listen. <laughs> listen. Linda. Listen, Linda. <laughs> listen, Linda. I guess that's like the, how like I have a million different sweaters and a million different colors yeah. and he I just, there, There's something has... for every, you know, occasion. If uh, again, whiskey drinkers, Norland, whiskey glass. Oh, I got you those last year. Yeah. Those are actually very pretty. Yeah, so they are crystal. Let me see. Scientifically designed for uh, drinking whiskey. Hold on, I'm trying to get it to focus. These are the neat glasses. Hold on, let me put it here so I don't ruin it. Drinking whiskey neat, not on the rocks. So this is what the glasses look like. They're actually very, very pretty. Well, they're very, very nice because when I got them for you, I was like, okay, these are pretty glasses. But no, I just, you know, I like Yetis. And you know, people come over and I'm drinking out of a Yeti and they're drinking out of a plastic cup. It's nice to have a variety. So you can offer them so a Yeti? Yeah. So you can be friends drinking friends. out of the okay. same cups. Same type. <laughs> when do people come over? Nobody ever comes over. <laughs> Thanks, Corona. Is there anything in the garage at all? Just all my gym stuff. Well, I don't think that we can show anything in here because the car is in here. Over there is the, uh, what's it called? The generator? Zero tower station. This is the big... Uh... No, those, are, those are the solar panels. But those are the little lanterns, which are cool. Because if we ever lose power, we can just put these in the sun and charge them, which no, is kind of well, neat. The little lights. These you got to plug in. But they are, uh, they're about the same company, Goal Zero. The thing about these is it's, it's you know, 180. Those are very bright. Light. But the other cool thing is, is that in a pinch. You wind them up. And then that's well, how they I mean, get power. Minute, we'll give you 10 minutes of light. What? That's not bad. I think it was 10 minutes. That's not bad. But yes, the other thing here in the garage is just really Joe's like little gym that he has set up. And you're not going to be able to see everything because my car is here. But he set up his gym with all this Rogue stuff. So if you've never heard of Rogue, they have like all of their fitness stuff. So he Again. has a timer. Yeah. What? Rig. He's got the rig over here. He's got all the Waves. plates. And he went buying this stuff. I've been building at this. Yeah. We've been, and it's not like I bought all this at once. That'd be super expensive. Yeah. But I just chipped away at it over and over for the past, what, three, four years. Yeah. Little by little, like whenever he'd get a little bit of money in his envelope, he'd buy, you know, like two weights or, you know, he'd buy like the, the yeah, the weights are really expensive or he'd buy the clock or he bought like different things here and he's got like a little box over there like the kettlebells and all of that so he went working on this little by little but maybe there's you know something that your man likes yeah, so nice. that also is very expensive yeah, but, but it's a portable it's a portable speaker. speaker he brings it out here when he's working out you just leave it out here now right I'll leave it out here unless we need it because i use it when i work out today. but it's just like a nice um you know speaker that you can move everywhere Armor up, Dynamis, all that. Yeah, he got his whiteboard. So he's got his little setup here. We got the freaking leaf blower that we got this weekend. That was like a $200 leaf blower. So I don't know. It runs off batteries. It runs go. off of the batteries. So I don't know if you live in a place where you got a lot of leaves, I guess that is like a fancy thing. We got a snow shovel. What? Our snow okay, shovel. that's not going on our, on our list, okay? <laughs> snow shovel. Is that it or you think that there's something well, else? got this. But the vacuum nice. the shark little mini vacuum yeah we use th this a lot that is one of our favorite things oh excuse me you just dropped it everywhere <laughs> so for joe that's always cleaning that is a great little tool we've had that for years that. we had sand because of the sandbox because of righty sandbox the sand has been everywhere is, it? is this still coming it's out still coming out this isn't designed for sand. Oh dear. <laughs> so yes, this is one of our favorite things. And I just like that you can just put it right back there in the corner. And our bissel. Cleans up everything. And yeah, the bissel you've been using lately, our big vacuum. Yeah. 
that one has been great too. So that is really it. I don't think that there's really much else that would be considered one of his favorite things. So I hope that that was helpful. I hope that, you know, just showing you guys around the stuff that he has. Again, I know that he has expensive days and he's, you know, a little bit strange, but I hope that that helped if you guys, you know, ex we tried to touch my boob, what the heck? <laughs> so I hope that that helped you guys. If you guys have no idea what to get your significant other, the guy in your life, I know that guys are hard to shop for, which is why usually he buys his own stuff. Like usually I don't buy him things and usually he just gets himself whatever he wants. I just ask for permission to buy it. Yes, you do because I love you and you want to stay happily married. Budget committee. I'm the budget committee. So anyway, we're gonna go because we're gonna enjoy the rest of our night, but thank you guys so much for being here. I love you guys to pieces. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. If you enjoyed it, subscribe if you're new and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Thank you.